It is the year of our Lord, 1228. The war on tyranny goes on, and it seems my tiny army grows with each new moon. The sheriff, thinking he'd driven me out of his affairs, relaxed after he stole my estate in Loxley. I did it. The beginning of my exile ignited the fight I should have started on my very first step into Nottingham. The problem was evident the poverty suffocating the land. The sheriff was bleeding the peasants try to fund something, and at the time, I wasn't quite sure what it was. All I knew was he had to be stopped, and the money returned to those who had rightfully earned it. The question was, what was our first move? And the answer was simple. Do what all outlaws do. Steal. But I was not about to descend to the level of stealing from a hard-working, honest man, so we set our eyes on not simply the wealthy, but those that had gained their wealth through dishonest and corrupt ways. We made our first move on the Great Northern Road that cut its way through Sherwood. You nearly st a bandit? Kill him! Stay where you are! My men have you completely surrounded. And should I give the signal, you will die. I see no gang of villains. Only one. Guards, take him. You fools, take him! I give you one chance. Your valuables or your lives. And take solace that your gold goes to help the starving and impoverished. The starving and... Who is this outlaw? Robin! Robin of Loxley! I had heard you'd lost your estate, but I have never seen a nobleman act with such dishonor. Dishonor? Dishonor? It is a dishonor to eat when your village goes hungry. It is a dishonor to sleep in a feather bed when your countryman sleeps in the gutter. It is a dishonor to have a strong arm and not fight injustice. It is a dishonor to have lands like you possess and use them only to increase your own waistline. My lands are Sherwood Forest and I will use its resources, not for greed, but to bring justice to all the people of England. You fool! What are you doing? I pledge myself to Sherwood and its king, Robin of the Hood. Rixley? What are you doing here? I joined up with this lot for safe passage to York. I never thought I'd see you again. Rise, Rixley. I take your service. Leave my forest. Now! Robin of the Hood? This is an outrage! This is a disgrace! This Quickly, get them away, man! Move! This way, go! Rixley was not the last to join our cause. As the days passed, our adventures took us wherever there was a free man in need. From the challenge of Little John. Undoubtedly, the bravest and most loyal of all my companions. And unfortunately for me, also the strongest. To the recruiting of Will Scarlet. Intrepid and headstrong, but a good man. Who once convinced of it? And the rescuing of Friar Tuck.
jolly and wise monk, and a good friend. Eventually. Rixley was sent to continue his mission, spreading word of the king's recent battles. It was important to keep the king in the people's hearts, or they might forget. However, we gave him another goal, to bring the lords of the land to our side, to oppose the tyranny stemming from Prince John and the Sheriff. The band grew steadily. Heroes! Every one of them. After some raids, we would invite our benefactor over to dinner. In the light of such merrymaking, my men were forever christened Merry Men. And I, disgraced Lord of Loxy, was referred to in hate or in love as Robin Hood. Gisborne. Sheriff? I have a task for you. Oh? I have a message to be delivered. I am no mere messenger, my lord. This is no mere message. This letter is born to London. I trust you know what that means. I understand. I will make sure it gets there without harm. I shall bring an honor guard. This marks the turn of an age. Careful! Gisborne. There are dangerous outlaws about. I'm not afraid of outlaws. My steel is a match for any band of scum. You need not fear. I hope you speak true. Now away. I have plans to make. <laughs> 